Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for taking the time every day to stop back at my channel. Okay, it's been a little bit since I did my last haul. The sun keeps going in and out, so the lighting is a little bit weird, so bear with me while that happens. Um, so, uh, what's been going on is my computer died. <laughs> So with no computer, it's really hard to upload videos and things like that. So Stefano figured out something for us to do until we get our computer back and up and running. If we get a new one or if we fix this one, I'm not sure what we're going to do. So Stormy and I are here and me is over there. So we are just going to start this Dollar Tree haul. Now I've had these things sitting in a bag for almost two weeks. So I also have another two bags over here that I just picked up today. Um, these are more or less, um, uh, they are more or less crafting items for me for fall. So I want to get my house in a fall condition. Um, I'm just like so ready for fall to be here. I'm not ready for the winter though, but fall I am ready for. So the first thing I'm just going to show you is in this bag here. It's a blue bag. You know, here we have to um, use our own bags. Um, so some of this stuff is new to my stores. Um, some is not. The first thing I have here is a door hanger. I got an orange one because that is good for fall and for Halloween. So I did get that. And I picked up this, this is like that, um, uh, what's that candy corn color? It's the orange and the white and the yellow. So I got one of them, but then I found these. Now there's two different ones here, but I am gonna make a nice wreath out of this. Um, so this one has black, white, and orange with uh, gold. And this one has um, white, purple, and orange with the gold. So I thought that would be a good combination to make a, um, a nice wreath out of. And then I did finally find, um, we had the string lights and these is, it's a 10 count and this is the little, uh, unicorn ones. So I did pick them up for my vanity. I know, um, I feel like a kid sometimes because I always pick up these little cute things. Uh, next things I found finally was the white pumpkins with the alligator clips. There's three in here. And, like, the packaging is, like, kind of, like, ugh, like, I don't know. It's, like, it was all bent up and stuff. This is the only ones I could find that were pretty good. So, I got those. Um, and they are going to be for a nice wreath. Also, here, I finally found the Flamingo Tape Dispenser. I found this up in um, the store. This one was at, um, I believe it was... Cause I go to three different stores. This one was up in Topsail, Maine. So if anybody's looking for it, it was in the front of the store, like right by the registers. Okay, and I found this cute little owl with his little dangly legs. I thought that was really cute. So I got that. All right, so that is that for, that's mostly all the crafting stuff that I got, all the new fun crafting stuff. Um, and then I found these, and these were in Lewiston, Maine. And these are the decorations. They're the ornament decorations. Here's the little eyeball. So you got two of the eyeballs. One is orange and one is green. And then the rest of these are just purple glitter balls. So that would be cute for a, um, for a uh, wreath, I thought. Then... You know, you have to, when you see stuff, you do have to grab it because you know it's not going to be there so long. So here I got these little chalkboards and I am thankful for, and it's a blank line. So you can write on here what you're thankful for. Now what I thought would be cool is Thanksgiving is having these on the, the everybody's plate and then everybody writes what they are thankful for and then you all show it to each other. I thought that would be really cute. These are really made really cute. These are chipboard, but these are metal pieces right here. I just thought that that would be a really good idea and really fun for Thanksgiving. So, even though it's just Stefano and I, it still will be fun. Okay, and then again, they had their wall art back, their canvas wall art. I couldn't resist, but I did pick this one up. This is going in my bedroom. I love this bicycle picture with the wood in the background. I just love that. I thought that was so, so pretty. So here we have some pepperoni. There's two pouches in here. Stefano picks these up for work. He gets himself these for work. 
a minced onions. This is the Supreme Tradition, and it is just, it's three ounces. That's not a bad price for minced onions, so I picked them up. And we are on a keto diet, so we still are doing keto. Um, so I will have an update video for you guys on our keto lifestyle. Um, it is going really well, um, but I'll explain that. All right, and then here, these are nature's recipes. Real chicken, um, so this is a chicken and turkey recipe and broth. This is for dogs. Now my dog, Delilah, is she lost her little front teeth. She's, she's getting really old, and she lost her little front teeth. So they are a treat for her for when we go out and stuff so she can have it out when she goes in her kennel. So I got her them. Um, I got some acello, and these are um, just some sponges for the kitchen. They are really nice. Then I got these uh, multi-purposes uh, wipes, and these are for Stefano's car. So when I'm in it next time, I will clean his dashboard. It really needs it. And then, let's see. Then I found a whole bunch of new washi tape. So our store finally had washi tape in. So when I see the new washi tape, I pick it up. I mean, I you never know when we're going to get it back. So some of them I got doubles. There wasn't a lot that I really liked. So I only picked up, I think, four unicorns. This is the unicorn one. It's really cute. You can see that. I got two of them. I did get two of the love. So these are the love ones. So I got two of them and they look like that. They look like this right on the front. That's how it looks. I got two of the owls. Now I, I should have really picked up three of the owls because I thought these were adorable. So I've never seen them before at any of our stores. So I did pick them up. They're really, really cute. They're like little character characters. They're so, so stinking cute. So I picked up two of them. Then I got a banner one. I mean, they had banners before, but these banners are different than the ones that we first got a long time ago, maybe two years ago. And then this is cactuses, pineapples, and watermelon. So I only picked up one of them. So if you could see that, but that's what it looks like on the front. Sassy sees um, squirrels out there, so she's going to cry. Then I picked up this uh, lip gloss, and this is one of the donuts. So it's cute, but somehow the bag, the packaging got all mangled up. So, so this is over the door hooks. Now I really like this one. I like how it has the hooks here and the hooks here. And I will be putting this on my bedroom door um, because we don't have a lot of storage here. Like you guys all know, we don't have a lot of storage. So I do use these on my back, on my bedroom doors, but I like this one, even though it has, it has eight hooks on it, which is great but it's a lot shorter than that really long white one. So I should have really picked up two of these, but I only got one. So there it is. Then I picked up these, and these are the Shore Fresh, and they are just containers. I got a really big one. This is for salads, but it does have the press. You push it in, it has the venting at the top. I thought that was really pretty cool. This one is 12.15 cups. So, and it is 97.31 fluid ounces, if you have that in, in fluid ounces. Um, and then I did pick up this Sure Fresh. These are two containers. These I will use for Stefano for his dinners and stuff. Um, so, and I do again like that they're vented lids. I really do like them. I wish they were a little bit thicker plastic, but they're not. Okay, and then I found some black peppercorns. Peppercorns are pretty expensive if you get them. And so I do pick these up when I see them. Not every Dollar Tree has them, so I do pick these up when I see them. And this is the face mask I finally found. This is Issei uh, New. Uh, yes to cotton protects and minimizes irritation. So is it a com it's a comforting mud mask. And then I love how it says 95% natural ingredients. So only 95% of it is natural. So, but I did pick up one of them. I am going to try it tonight. Um, so, you know, it's always fun. I love to do a face mask when I find a good one. 
Um, so then these they had these in different scents. This is in wash scent boosters. Now you guys know I don't use these for my wash. I do use them for my pets beds, their blankets and stuff and their towels because when they get baths, they have their own towels. So also I put these into my vacuum. Um, and this is in the scent lavender. Uh, it's this one is pretty good. I mean, it's not, you know, it's it is pretty good. I like it has like um, kind of smells like my grandma. <laughs> it is good for my vacuum and good for my pets. So, you know, for their for their bedding. I did pick up some Lysol. This makes five gallons. Um, it is the clean and fresh scent. I do like that. I like to change it up every once in a while. I just, I just get sick of smelling the same old stuff. So I picked that up. And then I love Dawn. Dawn is my favorite. It's my absolute favorite. But I saw this raspberry coconut and so I couldn't resist. So I'm going to just add a little bit of this to my Dawn because I just love the smell of it. Well, this one I can't open. I'm not going to try. Okay, guys. And so the last thing that I have to show you is um, this dark brown hair dye. I always use this. I do treat my hair really well, though, after and be right, like right before. I condition it a lot to make sure that this doesn't dry it out. I've never had problems with this, and I've been using this for almost three years now. So it's just for a touch-up. Um, so I want to get my hair back to the color it was because right now it's two different colors. So guys, all right, I hopefully I will have this up today. Um, if not, I will try to have at least two videos up a week until I can get my computer back. I'm not gonna be able to have videos every day like I did, and I do apologize for that, but please bear with us. Um, and if you like to keep up with me, please follow me over at Instagram. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new, please subscribe. I will be having a lot more um, Dollar Tree, uh, DIYs coming up in the future and I also have a whole bunch of crafting stuff coming up all right guys thank you so so much for tuning in and coming back and I apologize for being gone so long but I will try not to be gone so I will do my once a week Dollar Tree hauls so please stay tuned I will try to do them every Wednesday all right guys you have a good day and like I always say somehow some way I'll have an amazing day you make your day amazing and together friends we'll have an amazing day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.